Hello and a good evening from Europe. So, an important day and an important session for me today. Um, previous session, it kind of exploded with enemy contacts. And not only in one system, it, it was something, I would say, galaxy wide. I made a lot of observations previous episode and I won't go into all of them but for today on the agenda is I am back at HQ and I have a few decisions to make so to that end all settings have been made I am provided with a cup of coffee my smokes and my dinner is looking at me like what you waiting for later dinner later <laughs> so let's start up the game and I'll kind of start explaining in a bit what's going to happen today. Make sure you're comfortable as well. Plan those breaks well. And remember, the video also has a forward button. So if there are sections you don't like, sections that go too slow, skip them. <laughs> Z office with our dear friend Yalos depressed as always <laughs> I can't believe this expression <laughs> he really doesn't have much faith in the business but okay let's go more to the important things so a few mining ships have been taken out previous episode and um, it's a bit second guessing for me what's going on where I also do not like the fact to see all my mining ships blow up so I think the most wisest thing to do for now is to retrieve them and make sure my assets and the miners don't get blown up so to that end I will give relocation orders to all of the mining fleets well I need to go a bit smart about this let's see he is still mining check it's on his way then his colleague is mining oh, we need to bounce that order So the 11th, copy paste, lock and wait, start bouncing orders, check. Check. So that's already four ships, hopefully that will be docking in a few minutes, all safe and sound in one piece. It will kind of kill my um, income at the moment, sitting at 40 mil. Nevertheless, uh, I still have traders, so I am using hopefully my time well. Instead of being constantly interrupted that traders are under, under attack, I will have a bit of time to keep my traders safe and they also earn the most money. So hopefully we'll actually earn more than the miners are and by the time we figure out a strategy to deal with the threats 
as the Phoenix Vanguard. Then we'll uh, have mining come back again, or maybe earlier. But for now, for me, the most important decision is to keep my assets safe. Let's see if this won't work that way. No, I have to do them manually. <clears throat> That's the trading fleet. That's another mining fleet. Let's see, Heaver Twin 1, the over here. Lock and wait. That way I don't have to go up and down the, uh, up and down the list. So, um, also they here, they already stopped, so they're just moving. I'm done with them. Trading fleet, we're gonna leave the one alone. So over here we have two miners. Give them a dock and wait command. Now let's bounce their orders. So the mining is gone. Mining is gone. Check. We have another mining fleet. Two ships. Let's see, can I remove all orders? That's a bit faster perhaps. Dock and wait. I don't think that made a difference. Actually, it may have. Yeah. Check. Yeah, it, ha it has. <clears throat> Eva Twin. Another two minor. Remove all orders. Dock and wait. Another mining fleet, two ships. They are already docked somewhere, so let's have them dock and wait over here. They are also docked. Check. They are not all docked. Let's see. Dock and wait. Oh, they are. Or not. Check. I have to say, I'm kind of becoming slowly proficient at reading all the symbols and uh, associating, interpreting what symbols and um, icons mean. Notice things go faster. Lead ship will leave that alone. Fast response will leave that alone. So, quite a bit of ships now coming towards the station. Yeah, I'll see a few. Let's go outside and meet them. Uh, so, so sorry for the few losses we had. We had such a good run lately. Zero casualties every episode. I was kind of proud on that. Oh, that got crushed by uh, the market. I think we lost few ships, two, three ships maybe. Again, it's hard being um, sure that the data fed to me to the logbook is completely accurate sometimes. It, uh, it, it only causes more confusion. Yeah, oh, there's another one. Well, to be honest, it feels good to see my assets returning the rest of them, you know, back in one piece. I think I made a good decision valuing assets and personnel over greed and, you know, income. <clears throat> so this episode I'm gonna kinda scale back on the mining. And I'm gonna take another, you know, episode to think about what to do with all these employees and all these ships that are now doing nothing. Um, but yeah, 
we need to just wait. Once the Phoenix is here, things might change. Um, at the same time, maybe if I'm busy again with trading, some other mining opportunity turns up. It all depends a bit on the market. Speaking of which, might just as well prep the Osprey, just in case we need to head out ourselves too, but why not? Might be a possibility today. Mm -mm. And yeah, today I'm also gonna try and incorporate all the lessons that I kind of talked about, about how valuable is my time as a company director, what exactly am I occupied with, and why am I doing it and not an employee, so a bit more trying to be on the button with how much is my time worth, where am I exactly, and what's the gain of it, so in this situation, like I said, we lost two, three ships over the past uh, two sessions, one session. Um, who knows what we'll lose today. But, um, <clears throat> at such suddenly, for me, increased losses, I need to take a decision. So, <clears throat> previous episode I decided to go back to HQ, because that is kind of where my thoughts work best for now, given the situation. And, okay, I'm sitting here deciding, like... I'm losing money, at the same time gaining money, but it is a situation which is growing in the favor of pirates and car and Xan, so I pulled them out. So what I did is basically, how much is each ship? Let's say 300,000 credits. So let's see how much did we just call towards here. I would say at least two, two, four, six, 8, 12, 14, right, at least like 14 ships times 300,000 300, credits have been recalled and saved in asset protection, let's call it that. <coughs> so I think that is a wise decision which I've spent my time on. Um, so that move as a uh, COO, you know, as a company director, was a very strategic, valuable, accurate move. So, uh, with the traders, um, now having a different perspective because the traders are situated on large ships, they're far more better equipped <clears throat> to protect themselves. So, I could manage them remotely. Flying out there at this moment would be a waste of time. So, I'm not gonna do that. I am, like I said, going to prep the Osprey just in case. There might be also some medium ships on their way back, actually, so... Might as well cancel that order. <clears throat> now I know there are a few more ships that I need to recall, which might include mediums, such as these. Let's have them home. Some of them are gonna see this station for the first time. They've never been here. <coughs> Quickly redo this. Um, remove all orders. The restaurant is now open for anyone wishing to dine before departing the station. Check. Yeah, now there are definitely some mediums on their way back.
Yeah, it's actually very... I have to say, it feels kind of stimulating to see all these uh, assets <clears throat> in all these numbers suddenly So many commanders are gonna shake each other's hand for the first time as the as well. <coughs> hey, you work here too? Yeah, me too. Oh, I saw you actually flying by on the radar. Blah blah blah. Great. There's one of the bigger ones. a lot of money coming home. Yeah, I hope to be able to provide them with work really soon. <laughs> but I also do not want to see them die. sad really made a good decision so many commanders are gonna meet each other for the first time see where they work actually meet Yalos yeah, you're gonna see what you're doing it for it's the depressing face <coughs> and then once the albatross is done we can actually also start working a bit on the station yeah a lot of things are kind of Spiraling into something bigger now, it feels. Galaxy wide, not only just for the company, but.
Yeah, all good so far. I'm happy I have the required number of hangers. <coughs> <coughs> Carlos, you ever tried that human thing called coffee? No. Mm hmm. Right. Hey, what is up with you? You're not doing much for a long time. Ah, we might maybe have reached anger capacity. Let's have a look. <coughs> no. Dock ships 33 out of 57, so should have everything. Maybe let's redo the scripting. Maybe that's the problem. So remove all orders. Lock and wait. Double check the scripts running. Oh, work out. Have a look. <coughs> He's making moves. Ah, that's the problem. He was listening to his uh, music. I saw the ear parts in his ears. <coughs> now nah, he's really having a difficult time navigating the station. Okay. That will solve itself eventually. I try to do is send him the other way. Let's see, orders. I send you there. Ah, oh, he's stuck somehow. <clears throat> right, that will um that will solve itself. I'm just gonna give him a dock and wait order. I know he will eventually come back home. Right, so far it looks like I've got all my mining assets back, uh, excluding satellites and whatnot, but that's not important for now. So uh, what will help me is to kind of remove all orders and assignments, so let all these ships go to the unassigned ship category. Uh, that's not more possible. It's an assignment. That's the training fleet. That's a training fleet. Can actually open up these now. Not be afraid that I'll uh, delete one of the um, training fleets. As such, select them. Remove all this and assignment. <coughs> yeah, you don't want to be doing these kind of stuff in a rush. Definitely. <laughs> Take your time with it. So a few of them, let's see. They are still out. That's one of them. He is home. Let's have you again dock and wait.
And these four are all here, so let's select them. <clears throat> Remove all orders and assignments because they were never part of a wing. They were just doing on their own, so they were already in this list. Check. <clears throat> Quickly do some uh, administration over here. Rename. Copy that. Cancel. Name. Welcome to the club, my good Taladi. Okay. So, yeah. Total. Have a scouting for me. So yeah, I've kind of saved myself 26 times 300,000 credits. So that's not a b bad begin of the day. Um, that is money not lost. <coughs> so. Now it's time for me to occupy myself again with the trading fleets. So they are situated over at Profit Center Alpha. I think both of them are, <clears throat> let's see, one is full with nostril oil, and is that true? Partially. Nostril oil sits at 22. Let's see, trading fleet 2. Your traders, are they preloaded? All of them, yeah. So, US 22. <clears throat> Let's have that ship redock and fill up more. Nastropol against 22. <clears throat> Let's see what else. Bright Promise was also a good spot. So Teladium is still in the run, however I don't feel that's a good buying price. So maybe if I can find Teladium for 100-ish. Yeah. Check. Let's see Trading Fleet 1. Are your traders preloaded? No. Okay, I'm gonna send the first trading fleet over and work this deal. Cladium Foundry trade with purchase four. Make it so. Jack. Let's see. <clears throat> Gunboat is docked. Let's have that worked on. Two gunboats. Resume your duties. Rest of the escort is docked. Rest of the traders are docked as well. Check. So let's double check that the gunboats are departing and sinking. Sinking as in sinking with the... Uh, being in sync with the um, trade ship. Aha, uh -huh. and we're also, that's why we, I love this view sometimes. We need to launch the escorts part of the gunboats. I saw them on their pads. Check. As so. Um, resume your duties. Is that possible? Yeah. Okay, let's stay here for a minute. 
Let's have your gunboats looked over because we need to repair one and we need to have two new escorts. Check. Okay. Combat MK twos, combat MK three, false, mandatories, check. <coughs> When that goes down, we'll be ready, <clears throat> but I'll be smarter than that, so I'll wait till the two Falcons are done, the gunboat, the Peregrine is patched up, and we're at full strength again. I'll do for now I can pull two escorts from the beta group and assign them to the um, Peregrine <coughs> your duties <clears throat> now let's grab two then say we're gonna be attacking with in alpha So another decision I made is I'm gonna circumvent the loss of time by just uh, shifting assets I already have, um, which is fine because I still have eight fighters that I can launch, so that still counts. And that brings me again back to what I consider operational abilities, full operational abilities. Again, like one peregrine is okay, no it's not. So <laughs> I wanna have two peregrines, I just wanna be more operationally effective, have more guns that can shoot, have more eyes that can see. <clears throat> so that is for the rest done. Let's see, we're out here. What I would like to do for one scout is to start running 
updating trite office. Let's rework the area. Check. <clears throat> So we're going to get some fresh prices in um, that will help us determine demand. I feel same about the bottom right promise. So let's have that happen. <coughs> Update trade office. Rework the area a bit. Check. And another adjacent system would be too grand. Uh. Much faith in that one. <clears throat> My memory of Memory of profit, however, is interesting, so let's do a update trade office here as well. Work the area. Check. Same. Send out another scout. Check. Okay, <coughs> <coughs> the gunboats. I have activity on one gunboat. Two escorts. Gunboat two. Check two escorts. Let's have them also dust off. <coughs> Resume your duties. Eighteen billion. We had a lot of trouble there. Mastrop oil doesn't also seem to be at the moment really good, and we already have a trader there, so it's fine. Great. Already the two falcons are represent. So let's have them join and then we're completely ready. So, rename, let's have that copy pasted. Falcon Vanguard, name. <coughs> and check, two times an escort, selected as such. And then we're adding them to the better group as defense. So, yeah. Defenders, better group, eight ships. Check. Now let's double check. The trader has the command set to have them docked. So I'll need to double check if they dock. <clears throat> and otherwise I'll give them a uh, custom order.
Let's give them an order to dock. I don't think they're gonna do that. Dock and wait. Okay, let's start working orders, I would say. <coughs> So 47, Eight five eight and sits on eight three nine. Let's run that. Let's wait for now. Now. over here five thousand
203 <clears throat> Just empty out, at least you won't get pirated 20 Zero, zero, check. Then once we are done, we'll have the trader going back straight to profit center alpha, but I'm not locking any price yet, so I'll just give a dock and wait command. Now, first trading fleet. <coughs> Seems like they're kind of operating on their own, or did they just they just got to the system? Gotcha.
Well, hearing that money ticker go is always a good sound, so I think I've spent my time well. Let's see. What's going on here? Dock failed. Can we do that with you? Yeah, he's been having issues all day today. <clears throat> That's better. Ah, a solution for the miners. Good, good question. I think in a minute I'll need to work on some kind of an agenda. So definitely since things are branching out as well. And scaling up. Hey, there he is, finally. Yeah, last thing I need to do is wander around on the docking pad trying to come up with a solution. I need to kind of keep everything in my perspective. So at least the traders are making moves. In a bit I'll check if I can have the first trading fleet engage with uh, clients that need Teladnium. Then maybe uh, work from the office to establish an agenda. <clears throat> that way if one thing doesn't work I can quickly switch over to the next thing and not like again have this standstill like what should I do? And go over everything in my head. The restaurant is now open for anyone wishing to dine before departing the station. <clears throat> Whoa! Yeah, I can see why you were delayed. I'll be 
right back. Okay, let's hope this pen works. Another human technology. So let's write down in not a particular order, but let's start off with the minus. I'll just write that down. Okay, then we have uh, the albatross. Uh, let's keep that at building. Then we have the destroyer. Uh, let's kind of keep at trading. Then we have the destroyer. Let's keep that at security. And then we have the station. <coughs> so that's already one, two, three, four, five endeavors we're enrolled in so okay for the minus I'm gonna write down get them to work um, building <clears throat> I'm gonna write down awaiting albatross waiting builder for the trading, I'm gonna s write down expansion. So we're gonna keep on producing more. Security wise, I'm gonna write down the destroyer. So the Phoenix. <clears throat> and for the station, aha, uh -huh, building station that is kind of similar. No, but for the station, I'm gonna write down. Um, expand into storage right so that gives me a bit of a first indication what's kind of up where I stand at the moment so let's go back to the traders because that is something I can address directly and that's ongoing so the first trading fleet should be <clears throat> filled up with Teladnium. His traders are empty, so let's work on that magic. Teladnium still sells good, so yeah, it's worth doing that. Wait. It adds the right fleet. Check. Mm -mm. <clears throat> I'll give them a command. No, actually, can't straight away. Save time. Ah, oh, he's dusting off it. Too late. Transfer switch. <clears throat> no, 
now for the big ship. Retrade. Stock up on more. Excellent. So all the traders preloaded. Now we're gonna preload the trader again. <coughs> then we can put him to work. Let's quickly view how the second beat is moving. Yeah, still working clients. All on its own by now, so it kinda got separated. No, it's okay. So this is why I have the traders actually still in a um, squadron or in a wing. As you can see they are done with their individual runs. But in order for me to um, make sure they stay with the ship, I keep them in formation. So even when I don't have the time or the desire to script out that they need to land, at least they will stay where the ship is. So it will save me in the long run when I get back to the ship. You know, I can now select all of them and say dock and wait. So that kind of tricks I also love to do. <clears throat> so I think he's now going to slow down and land over there with their client. That might be a good time to have them all dock. They probably won't make it, but they'll make it at the next station, and so and so on and so on. Right, first trading wing is now fully loaded up. So let's see where the price for the Lardium kind of fares well. Two Two seven seven, <coughs> two five five. So, I think we're gonna go that direction first. Two seven seven. That's the whole ship and probably the traders as well. So let's move in, lock that deal straight away, right with. Yeah, all of the ship. <coughs> And then he'll be still buying for 270, but I'll wait. Let's first have this deal done. Maybe the price will go up because he'll need more. And then I'll empty out the smaller traders. Check. So let's see, miners get them to work. Where I'm operating at the moment, I don't really see any fields except for what we know is 18 billion. However, that is a bit of a gamble. <coughs> Might be too dangerous to send them out there again at the moment. Yeah, so I figure now let's not get too greedy <coughs> and uh, not engage with the mining so I'll keep it on the agenda but now is not the time not today not at the moment
So another thing I wrote down for myself is the uh, automation of trade. Still ever so curious what will be the best way to go about it. Let's write that down. I made trading level three. And on the security side of things, <clears throat> I also need to start speaking with, let's see, speak with factions, individuals, regarding and car threats. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, the trading ship made it back. News. It's actually docking up right now. Last of the small traders are docking as well. Check. I would say let's start preloading first. <clears throat> Okay, some business going on here. Okay, it doesn't concern us. Also, <clears throat> I've been wondering why can't I multi select? Transfer last with So if I confirm now Let's try that out yeah, That only applies to one ship Dock and wait Okay, let's select to transfer as with <coughs> so nostrip oil let's switch over to the uh, next trader that will be LWZ
now, so I find that a bit of a shame that I can't do it with a lot in one go. Okay, Nostra Paul sits at 26. <clears throat> Let's see, any cheap? 16. I think I'm gonna run that. Let's hope it's enough. 16, yeah, 39,000. <clears throat> um, trade with <clears throat> check. We're nearly going to make the sale here. Uh, price went okay 249 but that doesn't affect us because we already uh, locked the price earlier So that station I can actually provide by the traders I have on the first trading fleet. <clears throat> so they're running for 266 and they need quite an amount. So I might actually get away with this. Two sixty five. Two sixty three. Two sixty-two more. Not complaining. <clears throat> Perfect. I should also write down minus expand to argon space through large minor. <clears throat>
Okay, the uh, first trading fleet's now also ready to uh, conduct some uh, buying. First, let's go to the second one. So they are all filled up. Quickly run the traders again. <clears throat> Check. <clears throat> That's one of the scouts. Let's have him dock back. And Nastropol runs for really low at the moment here. Seven. <clears throat> Seven, one hundred, can do. Let's see how much do you have? Six. Eight, seven to cent. Check. Tino two. thousand so that will be the main ship Seven
kills the demand immediately. One hundred <coughs> check fifty. empty this one out. Six. should have something suitable. Let's empty this one out. Ten. Two, seven, three. Let that be the main ship. Three seven hundred should have left. Okay, that kills this system. Then I think much more opportunities present themselves. Eight twenty one. Oh yeah, I did purchase that license, right? So I now receive all station prices. I invested in that license. Twenty sixty two. Would that be the main? Can we empty one out? Check. And that's kind of enough as well, so that'll be fine. <clears throat> 5,000 left. I yeah, will find something, someone. Cool, he'll be busy. Uh, they are done for up.
So let's see if we can find a buy for him. I'm kind of inclined to do something else if possible. Something more towards, let's say, medical supplies. Something that's more substantial in numbers. Yeah, so we can make a 2x return on that. Goes for 89. Let's see if that's not an um, extreme. 9, 68, 89. Yeah, and they need quite the numbers. So that's what I want. I want kind of the same game as with the Nostrop oil. So where can we purchase them the cheapest? 36. <coughs> <coughs> Um, 43, 74, <coughs> 58, 60, huge price variations, 36, Thirty-six. Seventy. No, 37. Supply. 7. 7. <clears throat> 39. Okay, so 36 in, in the vicinity is possible. 44,451 units. Ooh, that is fortunate. So this will be kind of our main system, Profit Center Alpha. We get both Nostropol here and both medical supplies. Right, let's go to that. Right with medical supplies. Yeah, full cargo hull. <coughs> and probably I'll do the same. So we'll dock with the large ship. I'll do a uh, preload of all the smaller traders. And then we go back to uh, the large ship, go to another station, fill it all up. And um, that way we can have a bit of a longer run. Um, another thing I wrote down for myself is that I probably have made a decision this episode by gauging stuff. <clears throat> that I want to spec into large mining. So... We've tried to do that with these smaller ones, but we had similar experiences as with trading. Um, small and medium ships are just too vulnerable to operate on their own. Um, I have been thinking about the Argon Mining Initiative. That's also my agenda. So that is a separate mining ship. But what I think um, is healthy for the company at the moment is basically liquidating all the smaller miners preserving the crew so ship the crew over to another ship and maintain them put them for now on the station and then basically use that money to purchase a big miner um, because just as with the trading ships I think I can slowly put them to work leave them alone and whether there are enemy forces nearby stations nearby that will be not the, a present concern uh, such as is now so I think I shouldn't be too also you know spiteful about it because they have brought us a lot of money and they have also shown us that it is possible but we just need to spec it correctly um another option is I don't liquidate them all of them <clears throat> because in the future I might need them anyhow so I already purchased them why sell them and I also sit on quite some capital I believe so let's have a quick look mm, yeah, 41 mil let's have a think what is strategically wise Yeah, I would say they don't appreciate by the day. I still sit on 40 mil. 
So um, that shouldn't be a problem to purchase one in advance. Size large. Let's see, that would be um, the first miner mineral. We've never built one before, so ah, there is a preset. Yeah, I remember I've looked at it before already. Okay, once indeed. 333 three, three. So we already have three thirds mining. Then I chose for pulse. <coughs> Let's quickly see pulse medium. Yeah, rotation speed is what I probably want with this. So let's leave that the way it is. Software looks good. Mining drones 5 out of 10. I would opt for a few more, to be honest. Jack 7. <coughs> um, Base it out. Good. I've already deployed all the probes, what not. Check. We already have more than enough staff that can slide. Mining, mining, mining. Defend, defend. Check. 4.6 mil, that's not bad. <clears throat> um, yeah, let's start out with one, scale properly. And look at that, just in time for the large trader to arrive for the medical supplies. Man, I feel efficient today. I made an agenda, made uh, the call to get all the miners back. I made a decision what I want to do about the miners, where I want to progress. Like, yeah, I'm definitely stepping up. On a different level of leading the company. The most important thing is early on, not when we already are over in our ears in the mess, <clears throat> but kind of trying to plan things accordingly. So I'm kind of happy also with all these ships being in back order because they all just confuse that uh, heck out of me. It's uh, nice that things kind of um, get produced by the economy whenever the economy is ready for it.
Yeah, with Teladium it feels like you start the run and it's over. <clears throat> and the, the journey, however, takes as long as it needs to take. So it kind of feels wrong, like it's too big of a boat. <clears throat> takes a lot of effort to move it about, keep it safe. So I'd rather make more stops in the system. Um, and I think also by the time we get to that point where we're going to automate our trading, um, that will be the longevity of the product will be there. Uh, we'll be traveling around. So the most pro yeah, we'll have to see in the future how it works out. But I think it'll be easier with something as um, a common good. <clears throat> With Teladium, there might be just one company, they decide to also do Teladium trade and, you know, that screws me over. So, well, I might have one, two runs and the game is all up for the rest of the the session. With medical supplies, I can, f you know, I feel like I could just relocate them to a different area and they just move on like nothing happened. <clears throat> yeah, same with Nostropoil. <laughs> Right, miner has been ordered. Turns out I had a preset, and I remember, yeah, talked already lots of times about mining, especially the past few episodes. Yeah, station, let's also work that on the agenda. So I have standing on the agenda expand into storage. Let's add. <coughs> um, Yeah, build defense platforms. Check, that's been added to the agenda. <clears throat> yeah, and another... Uh Main subject for the agenda, so we have miners, building, trading, security, station. Let's add factions. So what did I already wrote about that? Yeah, exactly, security. X and speak with factions, individuals regarding the Xen car threat. Let's add with factions. Seminar rewards. Um, let's write down trade deals that might be interesting. Let's write down uh, mining deals. And let's write down recon. Yeah, recon. <clears throat> yeah, recon as in deploying satellites, doing a bit of the more lighter work. Basically what I did previous episodes when I uh, engage, not engaged, but when I committed to placing an advanced satellite in the vicinity of the car station. That reminds me, we could have a look at that at the moment, if that satellite still exists. Yes. So that makes us, let's see, let's go to that system. Satellite. Whoa, station is gone. <clears throat> when did that happen? been building a ship for that. Oh. Yeah, recon, I wouldn't know, maybe low priority. 
depending on mission reward because priority because it's gonna send me to places I don't want to be low priority check <coughs> All right, um, first trading fleet. All filled up, so let's have a look at your crew. <clears throat> so you are now running one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Your colleague is running three, six, seven. Check, we'll keep it that way for now. Okay. So yeah, <clears throat> we can definitely fill up again. Uh, supply sit at 52, so I'm not buying here. Let's see, 36, same system. We are blessed. With. Second trading fleet. Let's try and have. Okay, he's going to another system. Let's try and be traders dock possible. We'll do that in a bit. So let's see, destinations, quite some he has to go around. Yeah, perfect. <clears throat> let's kind of gauge what is the maximum price we can get for medical supplies, 89. 89. Eighty-nine. Okay, it's eighty-nine. And the quantity will kind of depend on station. Seventy six here. 
so I suggest let's start over there, 12.15 yeah, it looks like all the way here yeah 7,000, wow Okay, I also did not check how much that station off. <clears throat> okay, full capacity, nice. Okay. Seventeen hundred. Uh, still above. Uh, the f the t small traders do fifteen hundred. Let's send them. Big ship again. Twelve fifteen. So we can send out a trader. <clears throat> station I can kind of work on emptying out in 12 88 11.30 let's not be greedy 30.88 that's uh, still a good deal It's gone. actually a good thing one system that's traveling about
empty, he'll be empty. Ah, good work, good work. <clears throat> Let's check out with the second. Still running, perfect. Quick visual. Perfect. That frees me up to do some stuff. <clears throat> Can I help? Here you go. Profit to you. Yeah, good time to check how's the recording doing. Two hours, sixteen minutes, still recording. Enough six hours. Hard drive space. Check. <clears throat> Energy catalyst. Silicon and ore. Let's have a look at this system we're in currently. He was twin one. So they do fly ore and they do fly silicon. Buying. Okay, let's check out if we can locate that. They want a lot of ore. Not seeing silicon though. Yeah. So, right. Whoa, what happened here? Super cool. Somebody got, yeah, deleted. Right, um... <clears throat> out here, I kind of do feel okay to send out a few miners, see how they work here. Let's see. Let's get one first running. Local auto mine, you're gonna go for what?
local auto mine. Gonna mine for ore. US 21, confirm. Well, let's give you some pals. Mimic behavior in alpha. Set up another one and make him mine for silicon. He was two in one confirmed. Probe shows both silicon and ore. Check. Aha. Uh -huh. So helium, methane, and hydrogen. Let's have a look at the system again. Yeah, I'm not seeing that back here. Check. Let's quickly. A methane. No, nothing indeed. Okay, there is an accelerator. Um, he was 22. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Is that because I did? Exactly, yeah. <clears throat> So ore flies, methane, silicon we're already in ore we're already working on, so I could do methane. That's good. Let's have a look at the system. Let's add methane. Let's have a look at the demand. So that sits at 15,000. That's not much. Are there more contenders? 15,000. Not much, no. So I'm gonna go for one miner then. Let's see, his capacity sits at yeah, ten thousand eight hundred. It'll be less, but yeah, more than enough for one. So let's have him work at it too. So that will be local auto mine, methane, Evas Twin 2, was it right? Yeah, it's Twin 2. Um.
yeah at this point I'm glad I did not you know blindly sold off all the miners like I said to myself okay the company is in the position to actually order the first large miner and not liquidate all of them at once for it so that decision and the gamble paid off as well because I'll be making money while I'm waiting for the large miner that it feels good again like using everything I have in a responsible manner so you are coming back where did you come from Ah, you're still searching for probably a client to sell. No. Safe travels. <sighs> what a day. Much better than previous episodes. Feel that like I have more things under control today. Hey, Alos. Office yeah. life. Office life. Doing things from the office today. Yeah, looks like they're all good busy. Mm. I might run into some issues like some that are doing ore might be filled up with something else, but now it looks. Yeah, he's filled up with ore, but he should be on uh, silicon at the moment. That will be funny to see. Uh, he's probably, I don't know, going to sell off or whatever. Two, so that's two. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. Mm -mm. Right, so for now, mining is under control. Let's hope not too much angry traffic will be about today. Pirates and such. <clears throat> what I might do is leave things the way they are. Miners get them to work, let's kind of... Now... Yeah, let's leave it open. To be honest, I feel I shouldn't press things too hard as well. I think we're doing good. There are lots of things in back order. And that that concerns station matters, like the Phoenix. That concerns not trading though, right? So I have not yet thought about that. What I could do, we are also for now in a good position to invest in that. Let's first quickly see... Yo, he ran to that order quick. So let's have all his mates dock up. Dock and wait. Then we'll in a minute choose a new destination for him. Yeah, lots of things in back order concerning trade, build, station. So, yeah, <clears throat> for trade, I can actually also pre-order another large ship, at least get that process going. In the meantime, we'll keep working the trade routes. We'll keep uh, the mining 
kind of local so we'll only mine in heavers twin one and two because at least there i have the fast response so i can always try to mitigate that risk for them but any anywhere else yeah they just risk again being deleted by a pirate <clears throat> Looks like most of them are already bored. Check. So. He's still working, nice. So let's see, where can we find the next product? <clears throat> Medical supplies 36, but it's only 21,000 units. Oh, it's a start, right? to do is have him in time sell the uh, <clears throat> silicon he's gonna not do it on his own or is he that would be grand yep 
Yeah, he's gonna sell the silicon, so I need to have him sell the ore manually. Let's wait till he's done, then I'll please don't screw up his current order. Shouldn't be the case though. double check he's gonna run that before gonna mine again looks so there was another one silicon 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 or same deal for him trade with check the order is gonna yeah prior to the mining that is gonna situation is rectified so they are doing all so I have to check for silicon they're all good Check up on the trading ship that's doing ready to runs for a while. Nostropol runs. Oh, wasn't that one done as well? No, it wasn't. Okay, that is going well. He's making his mark. Check. Big ships. Alright, let's have a look at another trader that we're gonna pre-order. Place him back order. Let's call it that way. Arch. Heron. Default Heron. Software, a long range, basic scanner, consumables. <coughs> Right, another trade ship ordered. So expansion, trading. 
Yeah, well, I might do. So let's have a look at our personnel file. Skill level. It's currently, let's set it to captain. PFT-198 Is that a small one? Should be still it's a large one Yeah, what I think I'll do is I'll go out in a ship. See you later, Yellows. And uh, see if I can find out about what's going on mission-wise. The system. Military personnel, please report to Med Bay 6 for bioweapons clearance. Osprey, Vanguard. quickly kind of hover about here no mercy. 
I wouldn't be surprised if that's one of my miners flying there. <clears throat> hey, is that my trade ship? <laughs> so wicked, I can just like guess. It's like, hey, my colors trade ship I send one over towards that kind of sector of space look at that it is that however is not my mining ship that I know for sure it's an Argon design awaiting orders magnetar mineral check right <clears throat> what's going on Me, just to be sure, quickly take over your position. Greetings. Greetings. Check. Yeah. Is what it is. Okay. Quick check. Let's dock up at the station. See if that changes. Quickly, let me check. We have played for two hours and 47 minutes. I'm actually glad about it. So much done. Wow, in three hours. I'm amazed. Um, <clears throat> yeah, let's dock up. See if there's any change in missions uh, offerings. And then I might travel down to Ianamazura in order to see how the main faction there, what kind of missions they issue. Let's see. Dock up, dock and wait. The correct ship. Prepare to dock. Acknowledged. Requesting permission to dock. Docking permission granted. Bring the ship in slowly. Acknowledged. What? You're piloting yourself. With who are we having this conversation? <laughs> get the kettle boiling um, check the for the missions here and if nothing or nothing of interest I'll move on to Inama Zero where the main faction is located make sure you get something to snack and drink yourself get that stretch in get those uh, bones cracking and I'll speak to you in a bit
the ship will be undocking soon. Right, let's have as a precaution fast response unit kind of doing a patrol in the area. Kind of keep it that way. Um, that is kind of a combat order. So what I probably mean to say is... Attack the position. Area B over here 40 40 kilometers confirm check <clears throat> yeah, my gut feeling is telling me some of the pirates are getting a bit awake so let's have some show of force
Medical supplies all filled up. Let's redist redistribute that. Check. Now we can work again on filling him up. Mm, medical supplies 36, more than enough. Trade with. Second trading fleet is also done. And A trade still working. Unbelievably cool. Let's do a brief fly and wait. And bump that order up. can order all the other um, traders to dock. Entering system, Trinity Sanctum. Where are we now? <clears throat> Trinity Sanctum Eat Two star piloting paint mod Opportunity That is actually kind of cool Set up satellite now Alright, I'll keep my eye open for such opportunities. Entering system. Bright promise. Seminar. Three star crew piloting. Yeah, so that is in Bright Promise. Check. 
<clears throat> I have found probably a way to automate a few things in trading. Wow. Let's quickly gauge what these missions entail. Trade operations probably. Mining. Ship procurement. Interesting. Learning your lesson. What? Okay. Briefing. Learning your lesson. Basic shield generation coil. Oh. Hmm. Entering system, Yanamus Zura.
Navigation, prepare to dock. Confirmed. Requesting permission to dock. Docking permission granted. Affirmative. Okay, first I'll check here at the station if there's anyone useful to speak to. to you. You too. Yeah, I know him. Blueprints. That is also maybe not a bad thing to have a look at. Weapon, scout, just ships. Action structures. Scrap, scrap recycle. That sounds interesting. Uh, that's a story of its own. Good profit to you. To you too. Um, thing. <clears throat> Show me your licenses. Yeah, I own indeed the company trade offer subscription. Good profit to you. Thank you. I believe we are done here because um, she allowed, he allowed me to have these missions now. The dark traders call. Let's have a look over there. Can I help? Here you go. Good profit to you. You too. Not that I'm seeing it happening with that stock, but okay. Can I help? Here you go. Pilot in level one, management level one. Good profit to you. Thank you. Here you go. Piloting basic, check. 
good profit to you. See you around. Okay, back to the ship. And then I'll probably take care of the traders again. Yeah. heavy on the frames I might need to readjust some of the graphical settings I made episodes ago I've been noticing it out throughout several episodes now pushing it a bit too hard <clears throat> uh, check Let's quickly have a look at the traders. Medical supplies all filled up. Traders also. Check. Brother, brother. Currently still executing his flying weight order. <coughs> Ah, that's also interesting to know, <clears throat> because I'm in a system that is already very taxing on my video card. Even if I go to the camera into a completely different system and different ship, it also suffers some of that lag. Or by coincidence, these are <laughs> two heavy taxing systems, both on the graphics card. Might be as well. <clears throat> yeah, the best thing is um, I'll let the ships dock here, and then I'll send this big ship on onward to uh, to complete its trade routes, <clears throat> and then set up the other freight ship to do its medical supply runs and then <clears throat> I think I'm kind of interested to engage with one of those three star reward missions because that will open up a new possibility for the company to experiment if we can actually automate it on a uh, advanced trade protocol so the Earlier ones I've tried them out, but they really, really don't work with what I'm doing. So they might be handy when I have a network of stations, but at the moment, to do some universal trade, um, they're not suitable. So once both traders are on their way, yeah, I'll have some time to look into this. I'll figure none of the other large ships have been printed, and if so, they're not ready to go into operation anytime soon need to stack them up properly with uh, support vessels with equipment also again be there when they're gonna take actions
villager. Definitely be making a mistake. Okay, looks like all the traders are landed. Check. <clears throat> Empty. This one carry astral oil. where we can get some nostril point. 15, that's a good price. Ah, 16. Check. First trading fleet can start on its medical supply runs. Have some clientele for 89. Let him run that run. See system. Thousand sixteen. That will be the big ship. Incredible, that's a small ship. It's exact uh, 14, 15, okay. Yeah, it's in.
Oh my god. Empty me out, straight. Okay, that takes care of that. See what's up here for us. <clears throat> Increase portfolio, maintain salary. Okay, I think first let's determine what kind of equipment that we have. It's the trader. Let's go to the lead ship. So ten satellites, nine advanced. Yeah, I reckon we need to load up on some more if we want to take this approach seriously. <clears throat> Is there somewhere a dock? Stretched here. Request information for God. Dutch information granted. Quickly double check if. So we'll have to set course towards a equipment dock somewhere here. Check one jump. Quite promise. <coughs> yeah, let's stack up on resource probes. Maybe a bit less on laser towers.
We can now start preloading. getting feedback at the moment so I don't know who it concerns so check the logs maybe <coughs> pirate harassment company regard okay okay that's here a big ship let's leave that alone if possible position again to buy up more nostril oil <clears throat> 15 that's a steal how much yeah in quota let's load up <clears throat>
Right, so the equipment change has happened, quick check, how are the traders doing? We're almost back at 40 mil by the way, that's splendid. So zero nostril oil sold. Check. Let's have them dock. Looks like this is the final trade as well. Fully loaded up on Nostrup oil. Raiders. That's a good start. 3,069 Actually do that with a trader
thousand. A few 42, so I can maybe empty out empty out Changed around. Ah, it was ore.
check. <clears throat> yeah, and then uh, we'll have quite a load over on the main ship, but for now it'll be hard to get rid of that. Check. Guys are preloaded with a thing that's perfect. <clears throat> um, let's have you sell off that nostril oil, even though it's just 11. Yeah, and there are medical supplies again for 36. <clears throat> Let's see if there are some closer. Um, doesn't look like it. What are you trying? Check, and then let's make a move. Eighteen thousand four hundred, check. And note to myself, why don't I try to reverse it? So once I'm gonna preload, don't use the fighters, but use the main ships and then select all the others. Is that possible? No. <clears throat> we'll see. <clears throat> um, what to do? Everything is still being printed. Let's quickly have a look what kind of missions are here in the system. Increase portfolio. Ship procurement. Quickly gonna restart that at Yanama Zero. See if there are easier missions. Let's fly into the system and then we'll see what happens. Fly away, please. Don't want to just jump on the first mission I see, and especially one that might be a pain to complete, right? Again, I'm kind of looking at what do I have to do. How much does that pull me away from my current business, which is making me considerable money? Uh, what kind of risk am I taking? <clears throat> so yeah, I'm stepping into something new, so I should be careful, take my time. Let me quickly check. We are now at the four hour mark. Yeah, I don't feel like picking up something complicated at the moment.
Alright, let's wait for the other save to finish up. Crease port earlier, there we go again. A stagnant operation is an unprofitable one, which is why the Daladi Trade Guild is looking to expand our presence in a number of areas. A trusted business partner is requested to help us identify such opportunities and potentially provide assets to take advantage of them. Right. Hard. So learning your lesson with a hourglass icon looks like I have to identify something. <clears throat> identify profitable regions. Looks like deployment of some assets. Uh, ship procurement. Not sure why there's a combat icon on it, but that might be just a retrieval mission or something like that. Or um, making a ship. I can actually maybe sacrifice one of my own ships. So, yeah, I don't know. You know what? Let's uh, take one on. <coughs> what I might do though, let's hang about. So, going on here, that's a sand ship. Probably gonna run. Nobody's tagging it. Awaiting orders. Copy that. The Trade Guild is where some of the network's most promising individuals gather in one place with the aim of one day achieving the very fast orders. greatest of profits. One of these individuals was scheduled to lead a hands-on seminar on mineral prospecting but is currently indisposed and we would like 
At least if you could step in, okay. White ship, mineral miner, resource probe. Copy that. So, learning your lesson. Talk to Kiritis, Emelandis, Yohulbus the fifth. Right, we can do that. <clears throat> um, in foresight, I probably will call one of my miners over. What looks to be a mineral miner. Check. Collect 170 units. Check. Mission is set to active. So let's call one of our assets over. That will be our PPG 802. Let's have him dock at the station. Dock and wait, please. Then I'll give my lead ship the same command. Dock and wait. We have new orders. Copy Navigation. That. Fly to the following position. Acknowledged.
talk with the uh, person in question. Hello. Greetings. Come aboard. On the way. To you, dear Taladi. <clears throat> I'm aboard your ship and ready to go. Find all. Copy that. I think he's in good hands. Um, let me perhaps just go aboard for good measure. Back. Right. have a quick look. Right, we should find all there. Let's quickly look what a mission says. Find all. 0 0.12 kilometer 3. 0. Point Zero point twelve. Okay. Uh, nope. I don't think that really matters, though. I know for sure the lead has all the resource probes and satellites we might need.
Right, let me quickly in the meantime <clears throat> have a look at the trading fleets. Hanging about. Fully loaded on medical supplies. Traders are empty. Oh yeah, I wanted to test something out. So if I select him, yeah, then I can't select all the other traders. Try something out still. So um, trade with him. Okay, that doesn't work that way. <clears throat> now try the other way around. It's for as we. Match up. <clears throat> hmm. Entering Yanamos Zura 7. Check, and we can send him out. Okay, we have contact by the way. <coughs> Gumboat, do your thing. I think one gunboat is more than enough. We'll keep the other gunboat close to the trader. Let's see if he baits. So he's laying down mines, is he? What is that? Saboteur T deploying static defense. Laser tower. Well, that's not gonna help him much. Ooh, that's a friend foe mine. Let's get out of there. Let's hope they take care of that. Okay, trading fleet. We need to find you guys another op. So Medical supplies at 36. Let's see. Profit center alpha, check. Right with. Pillar completely up. Once you're done, you're gonna go back to Hevis Twin 1. That allows me to calmly work on these missions. Dock and wait. Other trading beats sitting by oh, idle, orders. sitting on Nostrop oil. Traders are coming back. Let's have them docked and then probably also call it back. <clears throat> Trader. 
Prado. Let's have you transfer wares. Lock and wait. I'm selecting ships now that are actually here on site. Otherwise, they'll be waiting for the ships that are still not here. That will only make the swap longer. That was exactly all in the right sequence. And once they fill up, I'm also going to send them over. So we are at location. Let's have a look at our cells. <coughs> Lead ship is here. What does the mission say so far? Find all 0.12. Okay, so let's deploy a a probe right behind us. Billion probe resource. I'll let the lead ship do that. <clears throat> Chip, follow back till further notice. <clears throat> Mission update pick up 170 ore. Copy that. So, I'm gonna instruct my current miner to start. <clears throat> well, let's see because. I should not do auto ore, should I? Cool. That's the lead repeat order. Lion wait. Let's cancel that. Hold position. You're gonna mine for ore. That's just a direct order. Let's see if we can fine tune this area. No, we can't. That's a shame. <clears throat> so, lead ship, can I give you a more specific order? So, for instance protect ship indeed so let's cancel your follow order no let's set up protect ship ship to protect it's gonna be us select check Confirm. Follow ship is bounced. Yeah. 
So the leadership is now protecting me. Allowing me to do my job. While still feeling a bit protected. Check. I'll trust that will go proper. Let's watch it from our perspective. is happening at the moment. Let me quickly check if the second trading fleet is its way. One more coming up for a swap. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
magpie mineral. Yeah, for some reason it's not registering. <clears throat> I have a clue they want me to do it myself. Hmm. Which is not entirely consistent. For instance, if you deploy satellites, you can actually have your crew do that in a completely different ship. <clears throat> See what happens if I take orders. If I take command. Maybe that will flip around. Greetings. Oh crap. Seventy units of all. Okay, we have that all dropped. Now let me take over again. Asteroid. Asteroid. 
asteroid. Container. Excellent. Perfect. I'm willing to accept that. Thank you for showing me the ropes. Copy that. Um, but this never ending stream of mandatory courses is starting to get on my nerves. Please get me back so I continue my own studies. Check. Close briefing. Let's get out of the chair. Let's see if we can still save the day by scooping up half the. No. Them are gone now. No, I think I have them. Yeah, we are 350. Perfect. Stable crystal. Yeah, let's collect that. Why not? Let's collect drops. And once that is done, we will carry our guest back towards station. Dock and wait. see the traders we have done the swap I guess yeah all of them are docked as well so we can actually finalize by loading this one up last drop oil so we should look for 16 <clears throat> in the right spot 16 that's available 15 even Check. Right with. Against any. Sell off of 1592. Done. Check. And once you're done, you're going to go towards Heva Twin where your colleague is and you're going to duck and wait.
All time for him to bounce his order. Um, protect ship. Let's see. Let's have him dock as well. Then I can step back into the other ship. Dock and wait. What a fascinating day today. There's the sheer amount of decisions I've made from from the head office alone. Let's have a look. Look, we're back at 39 million. So basically all the many I, all the credits I spent today, I practically earned them back. quickly check how far are we at 5 hour mark I figured as much yeah, as always I can stretch it a bit but it feels good to kind of um, look for a opportunity to save and end it for this session there are some more parts of the puzzle so I'll definitely won't have that all done in an hour Neither should I have that mindset that will only uh, cause troubles. <clears throat> right, what will be the next leg of the journey? Identifying protofootball regions, hydrogen resource probe, back to Ianama 04, check. Okay, he is gone. So am I, I'm gonna go back to my ship. Did it dock already? Yeah. Osprey, Vanguard. First thing I need to do in between is make sure that over at EVAS Twin 1 all the accompanying ships are gonna be docking so they are on their way. Other trader is on his way. Well I'll check. So I'll let that run. Giving me basically some time to work on the other mission. Which will see us Going to Yanama 04 again. Oh, that's this system. Yeah. Find hydrogen. We can do that quick. Let's drop another probe right there. Billion uh, resources. The ship will be undocking soon. Copy that.
Thank you. 
Okay. <clears throat> so let's see, let's cancel that order to protect the ship. Let's have you hold position. Ship procurement. Raider. We are looking to improve our trading fleet with a new freighter. We have spent significant time looking into areas where we are falling flat and having identified an exact specification for this ship and would like you to source it for us. Vulture Vanguard. <coughs> All equipment slots have to be filled. All equipment slots. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> ship value plus 50% Vulture Vanguard Okay Medium ship That will see us go all the way to Okay, that's where it needs to be delivered. Check. Mm -hmm. I could do that remotely. So the next phase would be... Again, a... Learning your lesson. The Lardy Trading Station. Yeah, so it is in my interest to, I think, spend the night here. So keep the miner here, pay for his expenses in the hotel. <clears throat> and um, have that ship done remotely. Vulture Vanguard, all the equipment slots must be specced. Check. So for me, it will be going back to the station and docking there. <clears throat> Ah, perfect. We made 40 mil again. So while that is going on, double check on traders. Not quite sure what's going on here, but he's maybe waiting for the fighters. His escort. He's making moves. Um, Vulture Vanguard, let's go and source that one. <clears throat> All equipment slots. Equipment compatibility. Equipment compatibility. Check. Check. 
check. Okay, nice. <clears throat> It'll be done. Let's hope I don't have to be in person there. check how many minutes do I have left? 45. <clears throat> See, Profit Center Alpha should be a quick travel.
Yeah, now it will be interesting to find out. Is this because there is still a pilot in there? Which we can kind of 
cheat, you can ask him to leave. Right, let's have you work somewhere else. <clears throat> and you're gonna work for now on my ship. As a marine, then I know Confirmed. who you are. Hmm. No. Sometimes we need to wait for that all to update. Not much change. What is cute one? Yeah, I think nevertheless I'm gonna leave that for the next session. Um, we had a good run today. Really, really, really happy with the developments. Yeah, I couldn't wish for more. And I think the best uh, thing that happened is the agenda. The agenda really helps me to now stay on track um, it's obvious that now things have branched and deepened to such a uh, extent that I need an administrative tool to keep everything uh, locked and checked so I'm gonna make sure everybody gets a hotel room somewhere here and uh, make sure that um, Still sits there, right? What happened? Oh yeah, I need to undock. That was the message. Check. Yeah, so we'll proceed next episode with all of that. We'll see what's going on. If I need to be in the ship or I somehow still haven't correctly outfitted the ship. But for today, wow. Let's have the save done, give us twin one. <clears throat> yeah, and I'm also really, really looking forward to fin finalize this mission. Um, having the level three seminar hopefully will unlock some new automation possibilities for the company. Because if I can let that trading do its own thing, then I'm really looking forward towards building the station, uh, expanding on the trading, uh, make a comeback in mining through L-Class. 
so yeah a lot a lot of things to uh, to look forward to if i manage to automate the trading process we shall find out on the next episode or the many after because yeah for now i don't know how long things will be in a back order and also <laughs> i don't know how many episodes it will take me to figure out how to uh, process the ship but things are looking good for now happy about it progression 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 thank you everybody for watching i hope you enjoyed and enjoy your evening day or morning whatever it may be we shall see each other on the next one be good be kind bye for now bye bye bye